The one thing every Sigma wants is to become a better version of themselves. In other words, upgrading to Sigma 2.0, the most efficient, effective and reliable Sigma. Picture your previous Sigma self as a thrift shop or a junkyard full of unwanted habits waiting to be sorted in order to create order out of the prevailing chaos. Upgrading to Sigma 2.0 is similar to the organization that occurs in a thrift shop to make it look more attractive and pleasing to its customers. Becoming Sigma 2.0 simply means getting rid of unwanted habits and strengthening productive habits. And here is a two-step process on how to become a better Sigma. Sigma 2.0 Step 1. Make a list of all your weaknesses. Research has shown that self-doubt, the fear of public speaking, putting others' need above yours, not saying what you want to say when you have to, suppressing your anger, being unrealistic, always looking at the big picture, building castles in the air, caring less about people's emotional needs, procrastinating, shutting people out, difficulty in asking for help, underestimating people, suffering from social anxiety, appearing cold to others and setting very high expectations for yourself and others are the top weaknesses of the Sigma personality. If you identify as an high energy Sigma, most of your weaknesses arise from your inability to logically and rationally interpret the meaning behind things because you rely more on your intuition, gut feeling, empathy, and how you feel at the moment before making the decision. In order to get rid of this weakness, IMG Sigmas have to rely more on their rational sides. Not every good decision you make is going to make you feel good, and not everything that hurts is bad. You need to recalibrate your brain to see things from a logical perspective and stop trying to account for everyone's emotional needs before making a decision. Setting high expectations for others, not talking about your emotions, having trust issues and social anxiety are just a few of your weaknesses. The source of the INTJ Sigma weakness is the source of the INTJ Sigma strengths. If you identify as an INTJ Sigma, most of your weaknesses arise from your inability to interpret emotional clues and body language because you rely more on critical thinking, logic, reason, facts and evidence to make decisions. You are driven by the cause and effect philosophy. You need to learn how to take the emotional needs of others into consideration before making a decision. Learn how to give and react compliments. Being emotional does not mean you are weak. It makes you more human and not a robot as people think. Caring less about people's emotional needs, being cold, suppressing your anger, setting unrealistic goals and procrastination are just a few of your weaknesses. Step 2. Make a list of your strengths. A few of the stereotypical strengths associated with the Sigma personality include intelligence, self-confidence, calm, humble, honest, funny, sarcastic, loyal, empathetic, analytical, rational, logical, disciplined, focused, smart, the mastermind, and a one-man army. The truth about these stereotypes is that no Sigma has and will ever possess all of them at once because of many factors like upbringing, environment, and personal motives. That is why some Sigmas are more creative than others, some more confident than others, and more risk-taking than others. But the bottom line here is that all Sigmas are equally wired and endowed with the same potentials to become Sigma 2.0. Even though Sigmas have the tendency to multitask in order to economize time and maximize work, when it comes to personality optimization, multitasking is not an option because change is a gradual process. The Sigma should practice getting rid of one habit at a time before engaging the next because it takes time to become Sigma 2.0.